to our first series of Demolishing Goals, Have You Tried Food Reviews? Today, Bentley and I are going to be going over Catalina Crunch Cereal. Um, this is a pretty amazing cereal, what I have looked up so far. It is keto friendly, vegan friendly, paleo friendly, low carb friendly, all around friendly. Um, it's very high protein and it's 100% plant based protein. We have not opened this package, so we're going to be doing a real food review with you. So the first couple of things we're going to talk about is where did I get this item? I got it at Myers in Richmond, Kentucky. Um, so if you have a Myers near you, it is in the cereal section. It was hard for me to find, and they had two different options. They had this, uh, which is cinnamon toast, and then they also have dark chocolate. So we got this one. We should have got both, but they're $8.99. A piece so they're a little expensive it's actually a dollar 28 per serving so it's not that bad when you actually break it down per serving um, so let's talk about the nutrients on it it's 110 calories for 36 grams which is also a half a cup I like to measure in grams because I feel like you get more than cup wise or sometimes vice versa um, it's got five grams of fat it has 11 grams of protein per serving which is awesome and then it has 14 carbs, 14 grams of carbs, and 9 grams of fiber. Um, so when you minus that off, you get 5 grams of net carbs. I did look at the ingredients. The They have their own um, Catalina flour ingredient, which is just pea protein and potato fiber. And then non-GMO corn fiber and chic chicory root fiber and guar gum. So we know that guar gum is made to hold things together. Um, I do like that it has non-GMO corn fiber because um, genetically modified foods is something we do not want to put in our body. And I want to break it down for you just when I'm on these ingredients. So let's start with potato fiber. They actually grind up the whole potato and they remove the starch and the protein and they just leave the insoluble fiber. So it's non-digestive, so that's why they can constitute it within a keto product. Um, then the chicory root fiber is a soluble fiber. It does slow down your digestion. It can also balance your blood sugar and lower your cholesterol, which is pretty awesome. Um, and then it has pea protein in it, which is a type of protein. Uh, whey is a milk product. Pea protein is a plant-based product. So it is supposed to be a lot better for you health-wise. It also has an ingredient called uh, calcium carbonate, which they have 50 milligrams of that in per serving. And all that is is a supplement used to increase your calcium intake. So I think it's awesome that they do provide calcium in this product. Um, it also has potassium, 30 milligrams of potassium, and that's from the potato fiber. Um, so I think that is really awesome. One good thing about this product is it does not have any alcohol sugars in it. It is made with stevia extract and monk fruit. So just to let you guys know that. We're gonna go ahead and open this item um, just to see how big the pieces are. So they're very, very tiny. They look like this. Bentley and I are going to weigh out, we have our scale here, and we're gonna weigh out a serving. So like I stated, a serving is 36 grams, so we're going to go ahead and do that. So we can show you what a serving looks like. And we do weigh all of our food. Very, very important. It's not that much. It's tiny, but hey, it's a serving. I mean, you could have two of these. You would get 10 carbs, because I don't do keto. So like, this would be amazing macros for me. I would have 10 grams of fat, uh, 10 net carbs, and then 22 grams of protein. And it's cereal. I know a lot of people miss cereal in their diet, and this is a great substitute for that. So, hold that. Don't do anything with it. I'm going to go ahead and do my bowl. We're going to do 36 grams. We're not weigh our milk because almond milk, for a full cup of almond milk, um, it's only two and a half grams of fat, one gram of protein, and one carb. So if you're only going to use a smidge of it, you don't really need that much. Um, and I'm going to show you guys up close how much you get in a bowl. So here is what a serving looks like in a bowl. So like we stated, you could have two servings, um, which would give you really good macros. 
So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna taste test this, right? First time we've ever tried it, we're gonna do it live on camera. I have Bentley with me to try it because he is a kid, right? Kids are very picky about certain things. If your kid likes it, then it's worth the buy because you're also feeding them a healthy cereal that doesn't have extra uh, ingredients in it that's not good for them. You ready? You wanna try it? All right, let's do it. Our first taste. What do you think, Bentley? Good. Tell them what you like about it. I like the crunchiness. Yeah. It is very crunchy. And it tastes just like Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Like, I can't really taste a big difference in it. It's not as sugary, obviously. And that's okay, because um, your taste buds change. But it is really good. Like, I like it. <laughs> it's crunchy. It's not, you can't taste the fiber. There's no weird, no weird aftertaste at all. So let's talk about this product for just a moment. There was only two flavors in the store. So I researched online. They actually have a website, us.catalinacrunch.com. And they have eight different cereal flavors. They have chocolate peanut butter, fruity, dark chocolate, maple waffle, honey graham, chocolate banana, mint chocolate, and then the one we bought, like cinnamon toast. Um, if you go on their website, you get 10% off. But on their website, you can actually get a variety pack. You can get four, six, or eight, so you can try all of them if you want to. Um, they do have a program where you need to sign up and have an automatic shipment to you, which there's no contract. If you ever want to cancel, you can. And it's a lot cheaper if you go through that um, subscription. So for an eight pack, eight variety pack, it's $69, which is $1.25 a bowl. Six pack is $55, which is $1.35 a bowl. A four pack is $39, which is $1.40 a bowl. This is with the subscription, and that's not including the 10% off that you'll get. Now, if you don't do a subscription, it gets a little pricey. So, for the 8-pack, it is $89. So, it's a $20 difference between a subscription and a non-subscription. The 6-pack is $69, which is $19 more. And then the 4-pack is $49, which is $10 more. So, if you do like cereal and you would want this as a staple, it may do you good to do the, the um, subscription because that's something that will keep you on your plan, but also be good for you. Um, I like that it is for a lot of different types of food plans, especially vegan, paleo, keto. Um, and like I said, I do low carb. I get about 100 carbs a day, but I'm all about carbs because I'm building muscle. Um, the ingredients, are pretty good ingredients. I looked them all up. Um, they are made for keto-based diets. Um, it is always better to eat clean, as clean as possible, which means, you know, one ingredient. Um, but when, you know, they're trying to mock something that has been around for generations, I think they did a really good job on this product. And Bentley's still eating his bowl, so he definitely agrees they did an amazing job. If you buy this product and you like it or don't like it, I would love to hear from you. Comment below, like, and subscribe to this channel so you do not miss one of our food reviews. We are going to be bringing you different foods each week that we do find in the grocery store. We'll tell you where we bought it, how much it costs, um, do a food review on it just like we did today. Well, tell us what you would like for us to try or try to find for you. And we will definitely do that. I'm really glad that we could bring this to you. We love you all from Goals Training. And again, as always, go Team Boss. I love you. Do you like your cereal? It's really good. Yeah, I already ate it.